were so happy on that shirt together. Playing in and out, in and out. But then, one fine day, oh, I'm falling! I'm falling! No! I was rolling, twirling, and finally bumped into this huge pile of garbage. No! Everything was so dirty and stinky. Eeks! But before I could understand, I was thrown into this dirty river with all the other garbage. Yes, I was lost. But I knew this was not the end. And my journey begins. What is this? Where am I? You are in the ocean. C can you help me go home? Well, well. Once you are here, this is your home. Nobody goes back from here, ever. See, the ocean of trash. Oh, who did this? The humans. Well, read, read what it says. 1992. I was not even born at that time. Yes, been 26 years on count. This fellow got stuck in the sea and never returned. I want to go home. <laughs> I want to be with my family. Some of the plastic garbage has been here for over 50 years. And I have never heard of anyone going back. <laughs> Ow! Who's that? You dare to hit me? No, 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 no. I could never do such a thing. I'm so sorry. I'm... I'm... You are like the garbage. Human garbage. They dump it all in our home. Does this look like a dumping yard to you? And then you hit me. No, I'm not garbage. I'm lost. And the comb said, and I want to at my home. And it's... Chill, dude, chill. <laughs> now, you gotta tell me, where are your peeps? I, I don't know. Somewhere. And I don't know what to do. I can take you up to the beach. It's dry up there. Maybe you'll find them there. This is my home, but you should go to yours, dude. Come along. Yeah, there we go. Hold tight now. It's so dirty here. Ah, yes, it is. And humans are responsible for this. They create so much trash, and then there is not enough space on the ground. And so... They throw it in the water. Just like they threw you, little boy. They use so much of plastic. That's sad. You know what's even more sad? Mm -hmm. Dude, the sea creatures eat the garbage, thinking it's food. And then, poof! They die. Not just that. Others get stuck in nets and bags and can't breathe. Some of them just get eliminated. Entire tribes and families. They should not throw things like this. Everything is mixed in trash. I got mixed with some curry and wrappers and banana peels. It's really bad. That's just the tip of the iceberg, dude. Oh. This trash not only affects my kinds. Once the plastic goes into the fish's tummy, the birds that eat the fish and the humans that eat the fish, they too will end up getting sick. But I've heard there are some people trying to solve the waste problem. Really? Where? Up there, on the beach. That's where they are trying to solve the problem. Maybe you can find your family as well. Yeah! But I promise you that I will do my best to help solve this problem and share this knowledge among other humans too. Good thinking. 
thanks for the ride. I am not just a button now. I am Blasto. Hey, fellows. Do you remember the first piece of plastic that you used and threw away? Where do you think it is now? Your homework for next class is draw five items of plastic that you use every day. <laughs> Not that difficult, huh? And where do you think these will end up when you are done with them? We will find out next class. Bye then. Keep it clean, everyone. Incoming message from the Waste No More camp. It's time for the Explorer Diary. Students, yesterday was so scary for Plasto. He lost his family and ended up in the ocean along with so much garbage. Did you see the chocolate wrapper that was in the ocean? It had been in the ocean for almost 22 years. And it's not only him. All wrappers that get thrown away, chocolate wrappers, chips wrappers, they're all in the ocean and they don't go away. They stay like new. How many wrappers do you throw away in a week? What about a month or a year? Be an explorer and go home and check your dustbin. Count how much plastic you and your family members throw away each day. Where do you think it will end up? Stay tuned to find out what happens to Plasto in the next episode of Waste No More.